Hey guys, it's Chris Lamb and I want to thank you for taking this time to look into getting pre-approved with us. If you're watching this video, uh, we've either chatted or you've found my page and you're looking at the process of getting pre-approved. It's important you understand a couple things. You know, in the last couple years, the inventory in California has been at an all-time low. Or in other words, there just isn't enough homes for the demand that people that want to buy them. And so sellers have been requiring a full pre-approval letter from anyone that's considering writing an offer on a property. What we've tried to do is make the pre-approval process very simple and very accurate so that once we get you a pre-approval letter, not only do you understand the rates and fees of the type of loan you're applying for, but you also have a very accurate pre-approval letter where we can show the seller with certainty that you're the best offer to take. And so by following the simple three steps below, we feel it's the fastest and most efficient way for you to get that pre-approval letter to know what loan options you have available to you and actually get some numbers. And so step number one is going to be completing a loan application on our secured link below. It's prequalifyreading.com. Uh, you're actually on that page now, so you should see the link right below this video. Step number two is providing us with some of your financials so that we can make sure to get an accurate picture of your income where the down payment's coming from, if you're paying, uh, if you're doing a down payment, et cetera. And then step number three is going to be either setting up a face-to-face -face appointment or a phone call where I go over all these options with you to make sure you fully understand them, that you understand your purchase power or the, your budget, and uh, we issue a pre-approval letter at that time matching the exact terms of the offer that you're wanting to write. And so we feel that this is the best and most efficient process based on our experience of the last few years. Um, there is a difference between getting pre-qualified and pre-approved, and I just want to touch on that really quick here. Getting pre-qualified is just talking to someone on the phone and getting some general ideas. A pre-qualification letter, most sellers will not accept them. Getting a pre-approval has three boxes that are checked. One of them, your credit has been ran. One of them, that your income documentation has re been reviewed. And the third one is that we have proof of funds uh, that you have the down payment or um, that we've arranged some sort of a down payment, whether you're doing zero down or something like that. So if you have any additional questions before you follow the simple three-step process below, feel free to call my office. We'd love to help you. Other than that, I look forward to speaking with you or hopefully meeting with you very soon. Have a great day.